Hey, my name is Agent Beamstar. Do you play NBA 2K19? Have you ever had this happen to you? So I'm gonna oh, look at my old dribble guy in the middle of the fucking park. <laughs> Go, patch someone. Where the dude, dude, no. So, Yo, where the f is oh, the back rim? Up, up, bro, I'm not, I'm not doing this, dog. That that's <laughs> New park, bro. New park, yeah, yeah. Join off then white, join off then white, join off then white, join off then white. Jeeves, join, join or maybe you were playing on the park and you've had this happen to you. Look at this shit, bro. My guys, there is literally thousands of people right now playing games of NBA 2K on grass and in in the in the place where you're supposed to spin the wheel, like in I don't know where what the. Imagine if you stepped on for a game and you was like, all right, we're just gonna play a regular game, right? Nah, not at all, sir. They they transport you to a whole nother place to have you play your game where you can't see the rim. Or maybe you were playing a game with $300,000 on the line and you had this happen to you late in the fourth quarter. Lord, you get the stop, you get a score. Oh! We got a guy in chat. <laughs> It's tragic, but it's so funny. It's so funny. It was an open layup, $300,000 tournament, and they lost because of a layup that hit the back of the backboard. Guys, like, 2K is not a perfect game. We know that. Honestly, I am enjoying 2K19, and they, they finally fixed uh, the leaderboards. In case you're wondering who was the top-ranked Pro-Am team, now you can check. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get my Pro-Am team all together and shit. And we're gonna rank our court up because that's the wave. You might be asking yourself like, bro, agent, man, let us know, my guy. What are these devs doing? You're telling me we're playing basketball on grass with no nets. How is that possible, agent? Hey, listen, my guy, I have an answer for you. If you watch this special edition Super Duper Apple event, you might have caught them, ladies and gentlemen. But this is what they've been up to, apparently. I previously thought maybe they just moved all the devs to like 2K20 and they don't really give a fuck about 2K19 they put like one guy on it they, they tasked one guy they pay the guy like 20,000 a year they're like here my guy fix 2K19 because that's the only reason private matchmaking wouldn't work on Pro-Am is if that's what they were doing I genuinely believe that no developer should leave the studio until the game is fixed <laughs> It's kind of like, I know they have lives and, and like they're already being overworked and we know the real answer is just to hire more people, but Jesus, man. Yo, today we're gonna watch a small little clip of 2K, specifically the main man, Mike Wang himself, at an Apple event doing a demonstration. Yes, that's exactly what the fuck we're doing today, ladies and gentlemen. So let's get started. 120 hertz display with pro performance and four speaker audio. iPad Pro is the ultimate gaming platform you can take anywhere. And here to show you what- Guys, guys, wait, did you hear her? iPad Pro is the ultimate gaming platform. Here I thought my PC with two 2080 Ti graphics cards was the fucking ultimate gaming platform, but I've been mistaken because of a Fucking iPad took the throne just last week, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, of course, that makes sense. Is Greg Thomas, executive vice president at 2K Games? Woo! Yeah, that's Greg. I love Greg. For more than 20 years, NBA 2K has set the standard for realistic gameplay and attention to detail. Each year, fans have been delighted to be able to experience the NBA on their consoles. And now, with this incredible new iPad. Yo, did you, okay, okay. I know it's not that important to a lot of you guys, but he didn't give the PC community no love, my guys. I don't know if he knows that there's a PC community. He has no idea, probably. iPad, 2K and visual concepts have brought that same console realism to iOS. Everything we're gonna show you today has never been possible on a mobile. My guys, do you see the guy on the bottom right? He's Asian. His first name is Mike. His last name is Wang. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the one and only Mike Wang. Give it up, round of applause. Yes, yes. You're right, thought maybe he was fixing a game breaking bug or two. Like there's thousands of them in the game, right? But nope, nope, here he is in this demonstration somewhere, probably in San Francisco or LA. That's where all the events happen. Shout out to Mike Wang. It's probably his first time out the studio. 
in like two months. But here he is guys, he's gonna give us a demonstration and this is very real. This is not fake or scripted like some of the trailers you might see at E3. Guys, this is an iPad Pro. This is very, very real stuff here. Device before. Choose your favorite team and players. Many of you may recognize Barclays Center. We've recreated it exactly so that your Brooklyn Nets feel right at home today. But I see my buddy Mike here has chosen the world champion Golden State Warriors. Mike, we literally were watching your fingers there, dude. You didn't click anything. The shot went up and you didn't click anything. Hey, run the replay. Mike's hands was off the iPad Pro and the shot went up. Yo, 2K asked Mike Wang to, to stand here and pretend like he was playing on an iPad Pro. <laughs> Do you think they have microtransactions on there? <laughs> oh my god, they literally find new ways to make money all the time. If you tried to convince me that they were working on a port for the iPad Pro when the regular versions on the consoles are barely working, I wouldn't believe you, but here we are. Mike Wang is dropping buckets with the Golden State Warriors. If, but if you want to play as Steph Curry, you can play as Steph Curry. Watch the player with the blue circle at his feet as the rest of the team moves across the court using seamless motion matching and inverse kinematics. Oh, of course, guys. They're using seamless motion matching and inverse kinematics. We all know what that is. We learned that shit right out the fucking womb. You ever think like when they're doing these like tech intros, like, why do y'all just say words? They just make up meanings for words and phrases, and then they're like, all right, they're probably gonna be impressed because they don't know what it means. Inverse kinematics? Who do you think, why would you think we know what that is? Why would you ever assume an audience of casual iPad Pro users would know what an inverse kinematic is? But I know what it is. My whole audience knows what it is because that's what the f we do. We study that kind of stuff, man. We're able to create an unlimited number of animations, all at 60 frames per second. Okay. Okay. That's, I'm not gonna lie, I'm talking a lot of shit, but that's actually really impressive, because just think about it. 60 frames per second with the graphics that are on, like, I'm keeping, I would never play a game on an iPad Pro, but just in terms of hardware, wow. Hey, 2K, take the guys you have working on the iPad Pro. Literally make, abandon that. Nobody cares. <laughs> Move those guys, however, even if it's two people, and put them on fixing pro -Am. And then when they're done with that, move those guys and then make them fix the rest of the park. My team, honestly, forget about those guys. Let's take a step back and look at this beautiful arena. It is beautiful, Even it looks good. Even the sidelines and the thousands of fans are individually rendered in high resolution. This new iPad is simply amazing. It is, but I also feel like they added some contrast to this. I don't know why, it just, it just something's up with the colors here, I'm just saying. And it provides an experience that rivals consoles for the very first it time. It doesn't, it doesn't rival consoles unless you have a controller with the iPad. Okay, let's take a look at a player. How about D'Angelo Russell? We Yo, D'Angelo Russell looks like he hasn't left the gym in six years. My guy's traps look like this. His shoulders look like fucking that. He looks like he just came out, he was casted for the last Superman movie. Uh, but like, yeah, the graphics look good. You can see the sweat engine looks beautiful. The graphics, you can even see the hair. Usually 2K is pretty bad with hair and teeth in their games, but it doesn't show the teeth. The hair looks good. The eyes look good. The facial expressions look good. We get it, 2K. You made your point. To pop. Just look at his hair, the accurate tattoos, the beads of sweat on his skin. Look at his earlobes and the way they're formed. Look at the voluptuous lips. Look at the broad shoulders and masculine stance, guys. What the f what's happening here, guys? We've even rendered his jersey down to the pinholes. Oh snap, the pinholes. Okay, let's get back to the game and see how the Warriors are doing. There's no time or clock, by the way. Oh, nice move. Nice move. This is Woo! stunning. And now we're able to add visual post effects, such as anti-aliasing, HDR bloom, and depth of field. It okay, all of that is impressive. Anti-aliasing, that shit, I, trust me, because I've been PC gaming a lot recently, that 
it messes with the GPU, yo. It takes up a lot of space. HDR? Come on, bro. Most of your TVs don't even have HDR yet. I'm impressed. How could a thing that tiny have all that performance? That is very, very impressive, sir. But if you think anybody is gonna be playing 2K without a controller on the iPad, you are out of your mind. In fact, we're rendering nearly six million pixels. Six million, at huh? full retina resolution. Wow. With no upscaling. Nice. Okay, we've got a little bit of time left in this game. Mike, why don't you show us what you got? Mike, show us what you got. Oh, time running out. Step, Step three, brings three. the ball up the court. Buzz oh. Oh. Buzzer beater. Oh. Game winner. Oh. Oh. Nice shot. UK Mobile. We'll see you on the court. That wasn't scripted at all, ladies and gentlemen. That was live and real. And if you can't tell by the smirk on Mike Wang's face, ladies and gentlemen. Whoa. Where does his mouth end? I don't know where his mouth ends and his beard starts. That is... Guys, um, if you were wondering why you're playing basketball on the grass, or maybe you were wondering why your layup hit the back of the backboard and the game, there was $300,000 on the line, probably because... This is what they've been up to. Probably. I don't know. I can't think of another reason why some of these issues haven't been fixed yet. I had an issue where my game was crashing all the time on Black Ops 4, and this shit was solved in three days. On PC, not on console, on PC, where there's easily less players. Activision still fixed the shit. I'm having fun with 2K19. I wanna keep bringing that up because I don't want you guys to think that I'm not enjoying the game, but like, can you imagine the enjoyment I can have if some of the issues were just fixed. Simple stuff like joining people's parks or glitching out or freezing or blue screening when you hop on the squad spot. Like just simple stuff, guys. That's all I really want. Someone sent me this link on Twitter and I was like, yo, is that Mike Wang playing on an iPad? I have to see this. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know what this video is. I just thought it was gonna be a lot of fun to record and I enjoyed recording it. Hopefully you enjoyed watching it. If you did, drop a like, man. Subscribe to the channel. Click on one of these two videos, and I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.